Hello First Baptist, today we're talking about workers and our verse comes from Luke 10 2. There it says, the harvest is plentiful but the laborers are few, therefore pray earnestly to the Lord of the harvest to send out laborers into his harvest. Now here in chapter 10, Jesus is sending out 72 followers. In chapter 9, he had sent out his 12 disciples. Now he's sending out more into the field and he's saying, look, the harvest is plentiful. There will be plenty of people who who need to hear the gospel and plenty of people who will accept the gospel. The harvest is plentiful, but we need more workers. And, and that's even more true today as the population of the world is so much greater. We have so much more access to the ends of the earth. There's so much more need for the gospel and for workers to be in the field. And Jesus says, you know, I'm the Lord of the harvest. He's in control of all things. He's in control of, of whether people can come to know him. He's in control of their hearts. And, and so we put that into his hands and we, we just need to be praying as for our part to have more workers to come out. And, and I pray that First Baptist will be a, a church that sends out workers, that we can be trained up, that we can be discipled and send out workers into that harvest field that we can see salvation it goes from here in Spartanburg to the ends of the earth. And that's our prayer. And let's pray as Jesus asked us to pray for workers. Lord, we thank you for this day. We thank you that you include us in your mission to reach the world, to reach all nations with the, the gospel. And Lord, we know from Revelation that one day that work will be finished and all nations, tribes, and tongues will know and believe in Jesus Christ as Savior. Lord, we pray now for workers. We pray even for workers from Spartanburg, from First Baptist Spartanburg, to go out into the field and to share the gospel and to work on behalf of Jesus so that we can see souls come to know him as Savior and that we can rejoice together in heaven. So, Lord, thank you for this day. Thank you again for letting us be a part of your mission. And, Lord, we just pray that you would hear our prayer that workers would go out into the harvest. And, Lord, we thank you and pray in Jesus' name now. Amen. Thank you, guys.